Okay, so before I even get started in this, all I'm trying to do is start a bit of a debate. Not an argument, not a fight, not any animosity between one side and the other, whichever side you're on, doesn't matter. What I have to ask is, I cannot for the life of me see what anybody could possibly see the benefit as in a 15 minute city. I cannot for the life of me figure out how anybody would find this beneficial. I'm a bit of a history buff. I read a lot about that stuff. To me, this seems like segregation. Now, if you live in Canada where they're trying to implement this in Edmonton and Ottawa, I've lived in both cities. Every single subdivision there already has their own hospital. They already have their own medical clinics. They already have their own shopping centers. They already have their own transit lines. They already have everything. So why in the world would you need to implement a 15 minute city in order to do what? Like I, I genuinely cannot even figure that out because to me, this goes back to the history aspect of everything. That's why the Berlin Wall was created, was to divide and segregate a nation. Uh, that's why the Great Wall of China was built, was to keep people out. That's why the wall in the southern United States is being built, is to keep Mexicans out. That's why black people, even after slavery, were forced to live in certain neighborhoods because they weren't allowed to associate with white people and so on and so forth. Everything in history teaches us that this is just another form of segregation. It's dividing people. And to me, it seems like it's going to get to the point where all of a sudden my sister lives in a different neighborhood and I'm not going to be able to go visit her without a pass in order to go into a different subdivision. I'm like, how does this make any sense? I can't, I can't for the life of me figure this out. I mean, if you have a different viewpoint, talk about it, tell me, let me know. I don't get it because again, from history aspect, it seems like this is going south really fast. And the fact that people are actually joining in on this and getting in on the bandwagon or jumping in on the bandwagon, however you say it, it seems like a slippery slope to me.